Welcome to my uh, Napoleon Total War Russian campaign. Uh, we're approaching sort of like the uh, dying moments here really, aren't we, where um, we're just about ready to finish off the, um, uh, the, well, the rest of Europe really, I suppose. Let's move some of these along. Um, I want to try and cover these areas that the British might be aiming for, and that could be one of them. So let's put something in there. Okay, and I'll oh, just speed that up a bit. Already been accused of being a bit slow, so... Ah, let's get him out of there, shall we? Um, in fact, what I might do is you know, swap them around and then put that one over in the port. Which is this port here, I think. Yep. Now, there should be a British... Oh, I was going to say British. There isn't a British army. There's just my army here. I'll um, move this army over into Calais, I think. Or I could put him over to there where those have gone. Let's see if I can cover all the bases around here, that's the main thing. All the areas that the British look as though they might be going for. Yeah, I think I can actually. Let's put these in here. Looks like there's some Opal Chenya in there as well, so we'll swap those around. Um, for those who are new to the campaign, they want to just come up with this then, um, come across mine, then this is being fought on very hard. So. Um, it does mean that the game is a bit slow because there's a lot of considerations to make, I'm afraid, along the way. So if I put a couple of Opal Chenya in there, just to prevent the British um, landing there. We're not at war with the British, by the way, but the British are the only, the only major power left, again, for those who are new to watching these videos. Um, so I've got Khan covered, Normandy. I've got Rennes covered in France there. Um, Bordeaux, I'm on my way to, to help out, and the crossing over here, which I presume is um, Calais, um, which is, no, not there, there, it's Calais, yeah, um, that's going to be covered by these chaps here. So I'll move those into position over there, ready to go across to uh, Britain when the occasion arises. Of course, um, Brussels belongs to um, the, uh, the Belgians, and Holland belongs to the Dutch, so I don't need to worry about those areas. It's just covering this coastline here, in case he decides to come at me from that side. OK, um, I have all my gents. This is what makes it a little bit slow, really. And it's moving all these um, gents around, moving across such a big empire, fighting in different places, um, considering what to do as well. It all takes a lot of time, I'm afraid. So I'm afraid in the these sort of later stages of the game, it is going to go, perhaps distinctly slower than some people might want me to, so I can only go as quick as I can go, I'm afraid, though. What have I got there now? I did have about eight gents in Moscow. These come all the way from Moscow, as you might remember, so what am I going to do with these? Let's have a look at them. Put them on the ships. In fact, I've got two ships there. I don't think I need to put, need to put them on both. That one moves at 26, and this one moves at 27. That's the brig, so let's get the sloop out a bit and put them all on the brig, because the brig moves quicker. And uh, where are they? Agents. So uh, this is a bit of a pain. I've got to click each one one at a time. It's the only way I can do it. Can't do them all at once. Won't let me select them all. I'm putting them all on that brig now because the brig moves 27 and the sloop moves 26. Uh, I mean they'll go a little bit quicker. Okay. I don't expect that I'm going to um, need these gents anywhere really. I'm just putting them on here thinking. I've got to send them somewhere. I've got to do something with them, haven't I? So, strange thing is, it doesn't show me when I'm in port that those gents are with me. They seem to vanish off the face of the earth um, for some reason. Now, I'm hoping to take Naples this turn, and then I'm hoping to take Sicily. So I say little or no point whatsoever in putting these men in Sicily. I really don't. Um, might be worth. Actually, it might end up going for Greece, aren't I? In those sort of areas. But uh, for now, I'm going to send them all the way over to here to Gibraltar. Yeah, it's going to take an age to get there, but then I just have to live with that one. Where on earth are we? It doesn't even show we've moved at all, does it? it show any line of movement. That always bothers me when that happens. Where are they? Come on, come on. Is that... that's not them, is it? They've not moved at all, have they? It always bothers me, that. I think, why on earth is that? Why didn't they move? Anyway, so they're there. Let's do that again. Sorry about this, folks, but... Oops. I don't know why it showed me up there. OK. Right, now we can see it. You can see that pit purple there. So that means it's going to take, I think, probably about six turns when it's purple. One, two, um, three, um, four, 
four turns, oh, not quite as long as I thought, but of course there's already the turn getting into that position there, um, which means that it probably is about five turns, isn't it? So, okay. Um, these here, uh, I'm going to put them back. I don't know why really, but um, it's just, I suppose, well I do know why. It's in case these start to produce what I want them to produce, which is spies, so I'll move the spies over. Um, it's just crossing the T's and dotting the I's really, I probably won't need them, and in fact I could just completely ignore them and save a lot of time on the game, you know, people want things to move on quickly, so that would be the best way to do it, but I'm just too, I'm afraid I'm just a bit, uh, I don't know, I'm just a bit too careful for that, so, uh, I'll need to con, I've done all of that, that's all, um, right, I should have an army, Somewhere that, why are you doing that? I, I'm clicking on Gibraltar and it's sending me all the way up there, but anyway, all the way down there, I don't know why it's sending me, but okay, I'm going to send these down to here because I want them to be able to take Gibraltar. I don't think he's even recruiting in here. No, he isn't. He's got some, was it, light infantry, etc. What are those? Dragoons, heavy cavalry, 18th horse guards. They look quite good, don't they? So, okay, we'll get those down to there. Um, I've got a couple of armies that I've landed in Marseille. Do you remember I landed some over uh, in the port and some I landed on the coast. Um, the one that was landed in the port is miles away as you can see. Uh, so let's get these moving anyway. So we'll have this one uh, over to uh, Rennes, is it Rennes? Bretagne, yeah? And just getting them in the right direction really. This is why I landed them here, because they're near a road so they can move that a little bit quicker. And these as well. Send these the same way. Um, it, in any event, they just need to be near the coast anyway, with, with Britain. So that um, when we have an amphibious landing in Britain, then they're ready to go in. Now these here, um, I don't remember I landed them in the port, thinking, oh, they'll be a bit quicker. Nonsense. You might as well just land them on the um, uh, on the coastline. Doesn't make any difference. So I'll send those to Paris, basically because they're a bit nearer to Paris, you're going up this road here, than they would have been this way. So, um, strengthens Paris, can't do any harm. I don't know why I'm putting this chap back in here, it's just, again, it's just being thorough, I suppose. Um, I honestly can't see any ships being able to get into that area anymore. Okay, let's have a look over here. Um, got a note for myself to assassinate the General in Naples, but I'm pretty sure the General's already... Oh no, he isn't. Ah, he does still have a general in there. Uh, right, which one do I use? Let me try this one. Can he reach? I think he can. Assassinate. 50%. Not bad odds. Let's go for that. Agent detected. Wow. No big surprise, I suppose. Uh, let's try this one, shall we? Assassinate. 70%. Oh, that's a little better. Should have gone with him first, shouldn't I? Assassination success. Okay, so let's take him out of there. And move him towards what's bound to be the next target, which is Sicily down here, isn't it? Um, I wanted, if you remember, to kill his spy with my gentleman, but I couldn't quite reach. I was that far away and I was so looking forward to taking on his spy. Um, I'm not going to attack him with any of my spies. Not that I really need my spies anymore, I don't think. But um, in that area, but... Um, I don't really need to take his spy either, you know, so let's get them moving in the right direction. The reason why I don't need to take his spy really, or I hope I don't need to take his spy, is that I suspect, or I rather hope anyway, that Naples are going to be out of the game shortly. So let's move all of these around, get them moving towards Sicily. When I declare war on... what's that? When I declare war on... Um, what is it? Can I move? Can I move him? No. Nope. No, oh, I think that's it for the spies. When I declare war on Naples, I'm bound to get Sicily going on his side, and perhaps Britain as well, and that's why I'm moving my troops that way. What about him? Have I moved him yet? No. So let's get him moving Sicily way as well. Okay. So, well, I hit Sicily with the um, spies soon. Um, next job is to attack and take Naples. So, let's have a go at that then, shall we? I've had a bit of a thought about how to do this, actually. What I've decided to do is to reinforce this because he hasn't got any um, uh, guns in here. Give him a couple of 20 pounders because he's got the nice heavy cavalry. Put him in there. Ok, 
Okay, so that's that arm in there. Then what I want to do is um, move these armies so that... Uh, well, I'll just get him out of the way for now. Because I want him to be the one that goes up the road. Yep. Then what I want to do is back up this attack by laying ambush. In fact, should I send this one first? Maybe I should. Can you reach? Yes. Move him into there. Lay an ambush. Now we can get there at the moment, close to him, um, because we're not at war with him yet. So I'm hoping that ambush is going to fox him. Uh, and this one as well. And lay an ambush here. 